Gail. Yeah, Michelle, the Florida Highway Patrol says there were 150 deadly crashes in Orange County last year. That's a record. The sheer volume of investigations coupled with the complexity of this particular crash made for a lengthy investigation. But tonight, nearly a year later, Osvaldo Javier Patino Vasquez of Ocoee is facing five counts of vehicular homicide. Investigators say he was involved in a crash at Clericana Ocoee Road and Gaymar Drive. A four and a five year old were killed, along with a six month old baby and two adult women. The group had made a left turn onto Gaymar Drive and collided with Patino Vasquez, who troopers say was going too fast. He was going over this posted speed limit, almost double the posted speed limit uh, when the crash occurred. And after months of investigating, gathering all the evidence, consulting with the state attorney, um, we did feel it rise to the level of a criminal charge of vehicular homicide. So with the five people that died, he was charged one count for each of their deaths. I and mean, this was probably one of the worst crashes that we had seen in a long time here in Central Florida. Patina Vasquez was booked into the Orange County Jail under no bond. Lieutenant Kim Montez said the traffic homicide investigator had been communicating with him over the last several months regarding this case. Back to you.